Hey guys, I'm Cygnus and welcome to the help desk. I decided to peer on camera because I love DDR Grand Prix. It's something that I talk about so much on Twitter and I've seen a lot of people ask questions or they don't really know how to get the game running or the features and things like that. And I'm going to be here to help you get through all that. There's a couple of items that you're going to probably need to check off your list before you even run the game. So we're going to start focusing on that and then we'll go on to the game itself. Now, first things first, we need to get you a Konami Japan account. You will not be able to do anything without one. And some of you already have one. Perfect. If you don't, we're going to walk you through. So let's take a look. First, you're going to go to this URL below. Go to register Konami ID, put in your date of birth and make sure you choose Japan for the region. That is the only thing you will need to ensure your account is Japanese. Put in whatever username you want, your password, and again, make sure your region is set to Japan and check both the terms of use and privacy policy boxes. You'll receive a prompt for a six digit number and the system will send it to you to the email provided. If you don't get it immediately, give the system a couple minutes or check your spam folder since sometimes it ends up in there. Take that number and put it in the page and you'll now be a part of the great Konami empire. Yay. Go back to the My Konami page. You will go to the left side of your screen and go to Payment Management. You will then be taken to a page that tells you that a credit card isn't registered. Hit register and select I agree or move on when prompted to authorize EMV3D to authenticate your credit card information. Fill that all in and click next. There may be a chance that the service refuses your card, and if so, either try again or try a different card. I have found in my experience that the service doesn't play nice with certain cards, but others do. In the next video, I'm going to show you how to get an e-amusement pass, how to subscribe to the game, and downloading and installing it. See you soon.